breaking news now on ABC News Live. Hello, everyone. I'm Kira Phillips. We have now gotten word that Iran has released four American detainees. Let's bring in our chief global affairs correspondent, Martha Raddatz, for more. Martha, what exactly are we learning? Kira, the negotiations have been going on in secret for months, and these four Americans have been in the notorious Evan prison for years. But this afternoon, the family of one of those prisoners, Siamak Namaski, says he and the others have now been released into house arrest. They will probably be staying in a hotel. This is in exchange for the release of $6 billion from South Korea for Iran that had been frozen due to sanctions. The U.S. says the money must be used for humanitarian purposes, but it's unclear how they will guarantee that. I can read you a statement from CMAC's family. He said, we are grateful that CMAC and the other Americans in Iran are out of Evan prison and will be under house arrest. While this is a positive change, we will not rest until CMAC and the others are back home. We continue to count the days until this can happen. We have suffered tremendously and indescribably for eight horrific years in wish only to be reunited again as a family. Now, three of those prisoners have been named in the past. The fourth wanted to remain anonymous. They are all Iranian Americans, but have been in that horrendous prison all this time. So then, Martha, any word on when they could actually return to the U.S.? I, I think that is the second part here, and and probably they are like they the Iranians want this deal to go through and be sure that this money is being unfrozen before they are released back to the U.S. But they are very hopeful that they will be returned to the U.S. after these long negotiations. Kira, all right, Martha Raddatz with our breaking news there, Martha. We will continue to follow this, of course, throughout the day. Appreciate it. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.